Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial video with Coding with T. So in this video, we are going to create our swiper or onboarding screen for our COVID app. So now, let's jump into the development section. So for the swiper, let's just go to the npm website and let's just npm install the react native swiper. For that, open our Visual Studio Code terminal and paste it here and let's wait for its completion. After the installation, let's just scroll down to its documentation and copy its import statement and paste it in our project. After this, let's just copy the remaining documentation. And now, after pasting it, let's just rerun our project and try it. As you can see, after rerunning our project, our swiper is working perfectly. So now, let's just start designing our onboarding screens. For that, let's just import our image And now let's remove and add image component here and give it some styling and the path of the image. As I have already saved our images in our ACES folders, you can use your own images. As you can see, our image is showing perfectly. Let's just change some styling of it. And now, as you can see, it's working perfectly. Now, let's just change the background color to white. So for that, let's just remove our background color. After the background color, let's just remove the flex one and give it some margin toe.
As you can see, our first image is looking perfectly. So for the second image, let's just copy this and change the path and give it some styling. Now, after the second image, let's just put some text between them. For that, let's just import the text component and give it some styling. As you can see, our heading is looking perfectly. So for the description, let's just copy that text and change and change the text between them and give it some styling. So now, as you can see, our first swiper screen or onboarding screen is ready. So for the second and third screen, let's just copy this and paste it on the second and third view. And let's just change the path of the images and the text. And now, as you can see, our all of three onboarding screen and swiper screens is working perfectly. See you in the next video.